got a Ryobi backpack blower. It'll start, but only on choke, and it won't run on run. It'll run on choke, and we have water and gas. So there's a high likelihood that the reason this blower is not running is because the gas in here has water in it. But uh, matter of fact, sometimes we'll even be able to tell it in the tank itself. Yeah, I see water. You can see the line at the bottom of the tank right down there. Right down here at the bottom, that, that all that down there is all water. Um, it's clear, you see it now? That's water in the bottom of the tank. If we unhook, if we unhook that line there and we start pumping that primer ball, pump that primer ball one time. No, pump that primer ball. Who's the primer ball? Sorry, you're on video, but that primer ball is right here. Pump that thing. This is how we get water out of the gas right here. Unhook that top, that right line. Put it in this bottle here. He's gonna pump that. No, no, leave that there. Leave that there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now just pump that primer. That's all you gotta do, baby. Babu, thank you, babu. I want to show you something until we get, I don't know, a little bit of gas in here and then we'll take a good look at it and I'll show you something cool. We're going to take a look at the condition of the fuel. Let's see. I'll just stick this right back on. Let's see here. You see that little clear line versus that green line? This on the bottom is water and these motors don't like running on water or we'd be freaking running forever because I got plenty of water. But yeah, I can re-pour all that back in the gas tank, but that there is water. So just basically, if you go slow when you pour it, and you just watch. Make sure you never pour any water back in the tank. You can actually salvage a good bit of this gas, this, uh, gas back out of here. So. Now we're getting close to the water line. So, that much was saved. Got about half water, half gas left over. I'm not going to risk it with the rest, but it uh, should run like a charm now. Let's prime it up and see. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Just remember, it would only run on choke before this. Let's see if it runs on choke or off choke now. Put this back on there first. First try. Main difference now it won't run on choke, it'll only run on run, whereas before it would only run on choke, and that's because it was running on gas. Water gas. Water and gas. This is one of the most common problems with gasoline engines that sit for a while. This one sat for about six months. And also sometimes rainwater gets in the ends of the gas cans, those newer ones with the secure lids. Those uh, secure lids will fill up with water and that's how you get water in your gas. If this doesn't fix your problem, there's a chance you could have a carburetor issue. The next video will show you how to clean out the carburetor. And if there's any other tips or suggestions you need, just leave a comment below. And if this was of any help for you, just make sure you subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you. This is really as close as I can get to the bee colony without doing anything stupid. Stuff.